Hey guys, thanks for joining us again. So, this is a TRI PRC-152 radio, a very desirable radio indeed, and apparently it has a functional voice encryption mode. Let me get right into it. So, on top, you have your power and volume knob, and right below that knob, you have a three-position rocker switch with PT, in a, which means uh, which is a normal mode, and LD in the middle, which is a mode that puts the radio into programming mode where you program the radio through this uh, data connector here. And on the right, you have CT, which is the voice encryption mode. So let me just turn the radio on. So when you have the radio on and your rocker switch is in PT, PT will be indicated here, which means the radio is on normal transmit and receive mode. So it will not apply encryption to the signals you send out or receive. Now let's switch it to CT mode. So when you put the rocker switch into CT position, CT will be indicated on your screen. And when you see that, this means the radio has turned on the built-in voice scrambler and descrambler. So how does it work? All right. So when you speak into your TRI PRC-152 radio with a CT mode enabled, it will take your voice, put it through a scrambler, and send it out. Now, if you're receiving the signal on a normal radio, let's just say a Baofeng UV5R, if you're, if you're receiving a signal from a TRI PRC-152 on a normal radio and the TRI PRC-152 has the voice scrambler enabled, we're going to receive on your normal radio without any decryption or, you know, descrambler is basically just garbled voice, you know, a scrambled mess. You won't be able to make out anything that's being said on your on a normal radio. However, if the receiver is a TRI PRC-152, or any other TRI radio that also has CT mode enabled, then they will be able to hear, they will, they will be able to receive your, you know, scramble signal, and they will put that scramble signal through a descrambler, and then what's gonna be, well, and then they're gonna be able to produce, you know, a normal descrambled voice that you've sent out through, you know, your, your TRI PRC-152 with a CT voice scrambler enabled. So, yeah. That's basically how it works. Now let me get into the pros and cons of this mode. The pros are you will be able to communicate securely or somewhat securely with other people who have TRI PRC-152s or other TRI radios with the CT voice encryption mode enabled. And that's pretty much it. There is no way to adjust the encryption key. There is no way to change the encryption or decryption key. So whatever... So everyone with a TRI PRC-152 or TRI radio with CT mode enabled will be able to hear your descrambled voice. So that's one of the drawbacks. And because there is no, you cannot change the encryption or decryption key, it's not really secure in the sense that uh, you, can, you can communicate without worrying that someone else will be using, a stranger with a TRI PRC-152 will be able to eavesdrop on your encrypted connection because it's a, it's a universal key for pretty much all TRI radios. So there is that. Now, the other and, and the most severe downside of it is if you're using it in a team radio setting and you're transmitting on, you know, CT mode and you have people in your team with, you know, baofengs, they're not going to be able to hear you. But more importantly, if you have people on your team without a TRI PRC-152 or any other TRI radio with the CT mode and they transmit on their normal radio and you have your... PRC, TRI radio with a CT mode enabled, they're going to transmit a normal unscrambled signal and your TRI PRC-152 or any other TRI radio with CT mode enabled will receive that normal signal and put it through a descrambler. And what's going to come out is also a scrambled mess. So yeah, with a CT mode enabled, the only people you can talk to are other people with TRI radios with CT mode enabled. And that's it. Let me just repeat it. With the TRI radio, with your TRI radio set to CT mode, the only people you will be able to talk to and hear are other people with TRI radios as well and with their TRI radios set to CT mode. That's it. That's the only use case for the voice scrambler on your TRI PRC-152. Okay, so time for a little demonstration. So I'm going to show you the encryption on the TRI PRC-152 in action. And I'm also going to show you why it's such a gimmick in the end. So yeah, let's get right into it. So for the first part, I'm just gonna basically transmit on the TRI PRC-152 with the CT mode enabled. 
and you guys will be listening to that transmission on a Baofeng UV5R Gen 9, which has no decryption or, you know, descrambler of any kind. And, you know, when I do this, uh, other people with TRI PRC-152 radios with CT mode enabled will be hearing a normal voice. And if you, but if you are listening to that transmission on a normal radio without a decryptor or descrambler, you're going to hear where you're going to hear uh, in a short while. So when I transmit, I'm going to say these exact words. Test one, two, three, test one, two, three. So listen out for that or whatever is going to come out of the UV5 on when I transmit into it with an encrypted PRC-152. Let me just turn the volume up. All right, let's go. Alright, so yeah, that pretty much demonstrated the encryption in action. If you're transmitting on the TRIPRC-152 in encrypted mode, other people with normal radios pretty much won't be able to, you know, eavesdrop on your conversation with other people with TRIPRC-152s. However, now I'm going to demonstrate the drawback of this mode, which is that your TRIPRC-152 will not be able to differentiate between encrypted and unencrypted signals. So whatever signal it receives when it's on CT mode will be put through the descrambler even if it is a unencrypted, you know, unscrambled signal. And when you put a normal voice through a descrambler, it's going to come out scrambled. So yeah, I'm going to transmit into this uh, TRI PRC-152 with the CT mode enabled from a Baofeng UV5R which has no encryption or decryption of any kind. And yeah, I, I'm also going to say the exact words into the Baofeng test one, two, three, test one, two, three. It's going to send out an unencrypted, unscrambled voice. And yeah, you're going to hear what's going to come out of the TRIPRC-152 with the CT mode enabled. So let's go. So yeah, hopefully you're ready to Oh, okay. So let's keep the volume on So that was me transmitting on the Baofeng UV5R without any encryption or, you know, voice scrambling into a TRIPRC-152 with its CT voice uh, encryption or decryption mode enabled. So you, what you probably heard just now was a scrambled mess that was unintelligible. So let me just uh, run this test again just to, you know, You've, you've heard it on the CT mode with the, you know, everything scrambled up. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to flip, flip it back to PT, normal mode, and you're going to be able to hear me talking to this TRIPRC-152 on my Baofeng with a, you know, normal unencrypted signal. And what is going to come out of here will be a, you know, normal voice. So let's just, just, let's just do it so that you guys can compare it to the scrambled voice. Yeah, that basically covers it. So yeah, let's just do a little summary. The voice encryption mode on the TRIPRC-152 works. However, it will only work if whoever you're talking to also has a TRI radio with voice encryption feature. When you have, you know, your TRIPRC-152 set to the CT voice encryption mode, the only people who will be able to hear you are other people with TRI radios with CT voice encryption on. And the only people you will be able to hear are those same people transmitting on a TRI radio with CT voice encryption mode enabled. When your TRI PRC-152 radio is set to CT mode, you will not be able to hear people transmitting on normal unencrypted radios. And likewise, the people who have you know normal unencrypted radios won't be able to hear whatever you're saying on your TRI PRC-152 with the CT voice encryption enabled. So yeah, it's pretty much it. Is it worth a hassle? If everyone in your team has a TRI PRC-152 and nobody on an enemy team has one, then yeah, it's worth it. But is that really gonna happen? Probably not, so yeah. 
The situations where the CT voice encryption mode is useful are very limited and very few and far between. So right now, I'm just going to say that the voice encryption mode on the TRIPRC 152 is just a, it's just a gimmick. I really recommend just if you're just using it, and, and you know when you're just using it normally, I really recommend checking that you have it on PT instead of on, instead of CT. Otherwise, whatever you receive will be scrambled, and whatever you are, you know, when whoever is listening to you will also hear a scrambled voice. So yeah. Uh, just make sure, just set it to PT by default. That's pretty much it. Thanks for watching.